Da 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 da. These are the clothes I bought. Skirt skirt. Hey guys, it's Han. So today's video is going to be a kind of a different style fashion video. I didn't actually know what to say then or what to call this video because I've never really done this type of fashion content before. But, boys and girls, with that being said, I really wanted to mix things up a little bit and kind of move away, not like completely, but just a little bit from doing hauls constantly because I know for you guys they probably get super repetitive and super boring and all of that. So I wanted to try and do something in a little bit of a different style today. So I'm sure many people have done this on YouTube before. If I can find the original person, if anyone knows someone who has done this video before, before I'm like accused of stealing any ideas or whatever, that's not what this video is about. So today's video is basically going to be a celebrity inspired outfits type video if that makes sense. So I basically picked out five different looks from five celebrities that I really love and whose style that I really admire and take inspiration from and I tried to find a bunch of different pieces that basically make up the same outfit but obviously for a lot less than whatever they're wearing it for because you know we're not all on designer budget okay. So I basically picked out an outfit from Bella Hadid, Madison Beer, Kim K, Selena Gomez and Kendall Jenner. Oh my god I had to think then who was the last one. So I tried to get a range of outfits that I would personally wear myself and then some things that are maybe a little bit more out of my comfort zone that I wouldn't usually wear and you know what I feel like I've actually done a really good job because I feel like I found pieces that are actually really similar and really close to what they're wearing in the photos as well so I'm going to include the photos as I go along and put some try on clips in and stuff like that as well and I'm actually really excited to say that today's video is partially in collaboration with Koi Footwear which you guys know I have worked with Koi on my channel in the past so they're basically a really incredible footwear brand they produce vegan shoes that are super affordable and really really fab of course and I feel like they have a really good wide range of shoes on the website which actually made this 10 times easier for me because pretty much everything was like spot on to what all of the celebs were wearing in their photos as well so all of the so all of the shoes in this haul are gifted by Koi and I do actually have a discount code for you guys as well which is super exciting so you can use Hannah 30 on the website for 30% off everything excluding sale and the Grace Fit collection. So all of that information will be in the description bar down below. Obviously you'll see the shoes and the clothes throughout this video as well so I'm just going to get straight into it. If you want, if you do enjoy, oh, nah, 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 nah. <laughs> I actually can't talk. If you do enjoy this video as well, please give it a big thumbs up and let me know in the comments because I kind of want to make this like a little series as well and maybe do more celebs and more outfits in future. Okay, so I'm going to start with one of the outfits that I would definitely wear myself and this is the Kim K outfit. So I'll include a photo of it here somewhere on the screen so that you can see. Um, I wanted to get something kind of casual but still a little bit glam because I feel like that's what Kim K is best known for. So in the photo, she's wearing a white crop top that's like twisted with a pair of grey joggers and some white heeled boots. This by far was the easiest outfit to do because honestly I owned pretty much all of it already. But yeah I just picked out my grey joggers from PLT which I already owned. These are literally my favourite joggers of life and uh, there's also very similar ones in Topshop at the minute and I feel like they're really spot on in terms of the fit and the colour of the ones that Kim is wearing just because they're more of like an ashy mild grey and they are cuffed at the top and the bottom and they're high waisted as well. Um, so those are the joggers that I picked out and then again this little top is from Pretty Little Thing. It's just Pretty much like the same. Like, honestly guys, I feel like I've done pretty good in this haul. This one's like a simple outfit, but still. Um, it's just like a little crop top, as you can see, and it twists in the middle. And I feel like even the detailing with the collar, the way it kind of comes in and then dips down rather than it just being like a round neck is very, very similar to what she's wearing as well. So um, this was super affordable. I'm pretty sure it was like eight to 10 pounds. Um, so I got that in a size eight. And then as I said in the photo, she's wearing a pair of white boots and I saw these on Koi and I was like, they may as well be the shoes that she's wearing. Like they're so, so similar. So these are just um, white faux leather boots. They've got a really lovely heel as you can see. Again, I feel like it's very similar to what she's wearing. Um, and they do actually have stud details on as well, which I know won't be the same as what she's got on in the photo. But to be honest, I actually really love the stud details on these. I think they're really cute. And there is a zip to get them up as well and I have actually owned heeled boots from Koi in the past and they are so, so comfortable on. Like that 
is the one thing I will say. Oh, love you. All right then. Okay, bye, bye. Bye. I feel like the toe obviously is very similar as well. It's got a nice pointed toe and the actual like height of the boot. They're like kind of an ankle boot, but a little bit higher, which I love. So I feel like those will look spot on with the joggers. And um, in the photo, Kim has put the joggers over the boots as well, which is how I'm going to style them. So... Yeah, that is outfit number one, and considering what she's wearing is probably very expensive, we've done it for pretty cheap, guys. I mean, what can we say? Okay, next up we have what is hands down probably my favourite outfit in this haul. This is from Bella Hadid, and I feel like me, and I know Mads as well, love, 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 loves Bella Hadid's style and fashion sense like whatever she wears like she always looks so good and I feel like she always kind of wears stuff that's like a little bit different as well which I really love so I saw this outfit on Pinterest I don't know how recent any of these photos are to be honest like I tried to search ones that are from this year um but I fell in love the minute I saw this I was like yep yeah, that is the outfit that I'm recreating and luckily PLT did something pretty much the same so I'll put the photo in here and um, she's basically got a kind of like a pinkish suit on so it's like a blade and a skirt. This is actually Mad's favourite outfit from this video as well. So yeah, I saw this on PLT and honestly, like, it may as well be the same friggin' suit. Like, it's so crazy. So this is what the blazer looks like. I feel like even the buttons, you'll see in the photo of Bella, like, even the buttons on her blazer have, like, this tortoise, like, brownish effect. Yeah, it's a little bit of a long line blazer as well, which I love because, again, in the photo, it's a little bit more long line because she is wearing it with a skirt. And this is the skirt that goes with it. So it is actually already a two-piece by itself which I love because you can tell that the suit that she's wearing is obviously like a two-piece in the photo um, and I feel like the actual style of skirt is very similar as well it's just a mini skirt and then in terms of the top that Bella's wearing I feel like it looks like a fluffy top like that's the vibe that I got I'm actually gonna get it up on my phone because I'm pretty much doing this all from memory at the minute yeah it kind of looks like a furry top as you can see from like the bottom of the top and the neckline but because it's summer it is literally impossible to find anything like that at the minute because obviously no one's wearing anything furry or fluffy so I just got a really simple um, cropped top and then I even went as far as accessories as well so I just got a bag from Misguided which I feel like you can't really see a lot of the bag in the photo but you can tell it is a shoulder bag which this is literally the same like it just sits on your shoulder and I feel like it's a similar vibe in terms of the fabric because it kind of looks like a leather or like a patent leather bag is that how you say that word? Probably not. <laughs> and then I even went as far, boys and girls, as to get sunglasses. So I couldn't really find any, like, exactly like the ones that she's wearing. But I just picked out these from Topshop, which are similar in terms of the colour and the actual lens. Like, they're kind of like a faded, like, muted brown colour. Um, and then the shape is pretty much the tiny bit of difference because hers are more of, like, a rectangle shape. And these are a little bit more of, like, a cat shape. And then in the photo, she's wearing it with socks and chunky trainers. So obviously, you can wear any socks that you like. And then... I I saw these on Koi which these actually weren't in stock when I last like shopped on there and honestly I am so glad that I came across these because how gorgeous are these trainers they're just like obviously a chunky pair of trainers similar to what Bella is wearing in the photo just all white with bits of cream um, which again is pretty much similar to hers hers have like tiny bits of pops of color but I kind of prefer the all white because you guys know I'm a sucker for all white trainers like they're by far my favorite shoes to wear I just think they look gorgeous on and they're perfect for the summertime so those are the shoes that I'm going to be wearing them with again um, these are like vegan and all that good stuff and trainers from Koi are so so comfy as well got little laces which I love and I love the shape I love how they're kind of like quite a chunky heel and then, and then they go down into more of like a chunky toe as well they just feel really good quality and they last really well as well which is amazing so yeah that is the Bella Hadid outfit as I said it is mine and Mad's fave so let me know in the comments which is yours <laughs> okay next up we're going to do the Queen Madison Bay. you guys know I love Madison Bear. I think she's absolutely stunning and again I love pretty much everything that she wears. It's basically a black satin corset with denim shorts, a bomber and some over knee boots and a little belt. Again I feel like I did a really good job of this one. So the corset that I picked out is from PLT. What's new? So it's just a satin corset as you can see which I feel like the one that she's wearing in the photo is very simple, very similar. Um, hers is more of a straight neckline as opposed to a sweetheart neckline but it's such a minimal difference I feel like it doesn't really matter and then in terms of these shorts I try to get some that are pretty much the same color it's kind of do you know what? it's really hard with denim because obviously when a photo's got like a filter or it's been edited or whatever it's hard to know like what color the denim actually is and um, but it kind of looked like a medium to light wash so I picked these out again from PLT and um, their shorts fit really lovely and these don't have any rips either which is 
the same with hers. And then the bell as well, I feel like I did a pretty good job of. It's kind of hard to tell like exactly what it is because it's quite fuzzy when you zoom into the photo, but it looked like some sort of like snake skin or animal print type of vibe. So I actually found this bell on John Lewis, believe it or not, and it was reduced in the sale to £13, which is amazing. So this is just a really slim, I feel like it's pretty much the same width as well as what she's wearing, just a little belt to go with the shorts because I wanted to do all of the details and go full out. And then you can't tell as much in this photo, but there are other photos on her Instagram where you can see. Um, she's got a bomber jacket that's like more on her sleeves. The closest thing that I could find in terms of a chunky bomber at the minute is this one. Fun fact about this bomber, okay, so <laughs> I actually need to get my a new one of these because man's let me borrow this very bomber at park life i dropped it in the mud and there was literally no point saving it it was like past the point of return so i need to get her a new one as well but i fell in love with this when she let me borrow it because it's just really chunky and really oversized similar to what she's wearing in the photo madison beer and then in terms of the shoes her albany boots look kind of like a shiny leather and there weren't anything identical on the koi website but i picked these up instead because i I feel like her boots kind of were a little bit more like loud to some degree like they kind of were a central point of the outfit so I wanted to get some statement boots that would do a similar sort of thing so these from Koi are similar in the sense of the heel and the toe they're like a pointed toe again which I love and um, but they are really gorgeous like statement over knee boots which I love so they're half kind of like a suede and then half um leather as you can see and they've kind of got Kind of like a crocodile effect on the leather which i think is super super cute and then there's a lace up all the way up as you can see i'm actually obsessed with these like i can't wait to wear these because i've not had a good pair of overny boots for nights out in so long and i feel like these would be so so perfect for nights out with like a play suit shorts skirts like that kind of vibe as well obviously like for an outfit like this um, so they're not exactly like identical to what she's wearing but I feel like they'll do the same job in the sense that they're more of like a statement boo. Ha! Okay, next up we have Miss Kendall Jenner, which she is beautiful, of course. Kendall Jenner, like, I die. She's so stunning. Um, I saw, again, this outfit on Pinterest, and I just fell in love with it. I feel like it's really simple, and she's obviously wearing it out in the day, but it'd make a really good evening outfit as well. Um, it's basically a black leather dress, like a short-sleeved short leather dress with little lace-up ankle boots and a clip. And I even went as far as to pick out some clips for this as well. So... The dress that I picked up is very similar in the sense of the neckline, the whole like collar situation, like it's kind of like a biker leather jacket I would say. Um, the only thing that's not the same is the sleeves, obviously this is long sleeved and the one that Kendall's wearing is short sleeve, but everything else is pretty much identical in terms of the length. I'm kind of tempted to like cut the sleeves and see if I can make it identical to what she's wearing and maybe like cut them and like roll them up under, but I'm scared that that would also go completely tits up, so maybe we won't try that, but you know, could be an idea if you want to go all the way out there. And then yeah, the um, clips that I got are from Urban Outfitters. I was trying really hard to like zoom in on the photo and see exactly what type of clip she was wearing. So this is what they look like as you can see. They're just like a really nice soft soft. That was definitely not the word that should have come out my mouth there. There's nothing soft about a clip. Um, they're just like a really pretty black mild situation. It's kind of like a marble effect to some degree. So she's just wearing one clipped into the side of her hair so I'm going to do a similar vibe when I do the try on clips just so that you guys can see like the full look and stuff like that but I'm actually really excited to wear those otherwise like I really enjoy wearing clips at the minute so these I feel like are super cute <laughs> and then the boots we've got from Koi are actually a pair of lace up ankle boots so um, I actually have a very very similar pair to these already from Koi which I absolutely love and um, these ones are similar in the sense they're very similar to what she's wearing in the photo they've got the same sort of point to the toe a chunky heel I'm pretty sure she is wearing in the photo as well. I need to double check now. <laughs> oh, it's hard to see actually. Oh, you can't actually see the heel in the photo, so to be honest, like that doesn't matter as much. But the whole vibe with the lace up is literally identical. Like, I feel like when these are on my feet with the dress, it's gonna look like completely as to what she's wearing in the photo. So I'm obsessed with these. I love them. A pair of little black boots go with everything, and they've got a zip at the side as well to help get them on, which I love, and obviously the lace up detail is gorgeous so i'm really excited to wear those and i know for a fact they're going to be comfortable on because they have got the chunky heel okay and then very last but not least we have selena gomez which this is probably the most 
unlike me thing to wear I would say so that outfit that I picked out for Selena is basically a day dress because I saw this spot on Instagram and I just thought she looked so beautiful and like the whole outfit was just so effortless and like simple and I just loved it so it's basically a kind of like a maxi like a mid axi dress I guess if we're gonna get technical um with a little slit and short sleeves and a little collar and it's got really beautiful like yellow flowers all over it um, I was kind of searching online for like day dresses. I feel like you could have got a, a lot of different things for this, but I saw this one on Miss Selvage and this is kind of like the most similar I could find, but it's not like spot on. So it was kind of either compromising on the actual print or compromising on the fit of the dress. And I feel like this one, because the print looks so similar, like this is what I wanted to pick up. So this is from Miss Selvage, as I said, and it's got really pretty sunflowers all over. Like I feel like the print is basically spot on to what she's wearing it's just the actual style it's a little bit different so this one's more of a kimono style dress as you can see I'm gonna try and maybe like pin it or do something to it to make it look a little bit more like the Selena one but it's still very similar in terms of the sleeves and things like that and it does have the sort of um, slit detail as well going up the center of the dress which I thought looked really cute this was in the sale for like 22 pound guys like honestly bargain this whole haul like I managed to find so many things in the sale for this like I have no idea how and then you might not be able to tell very well in the photo but she is actually carrying a bag as well so she's carrying what looks like a small white like square bag I guess so I found this one on misguided which I feel like looks is gonna look like the exact same as what she's got on in the photo it's literally just a structured square white bag like the complete same vibe and then at the trainers that I picked out for this are slightly different to the Bella Hadid trainers because hers are more like bowling style type trainers if you know what I'm trying to say they're more of like a not a chunky trainer like a flat trainer <laughs> My description is not great. Um, so these ones on Koi, I feel like are basically identical. Like they look the exact same. They have these in a couple of different colors, which I really love. Like they have a lot of the trainers in different styles and different colors, which is really cool. But I picked these ones out because she is also wearing um, all white trainers in the photo. So they just look like so. They're again, the same kind of like bowling shoe style trainer, which I really love. Like I'm either gonna wear, if I'm gonna wear trainers, I'm either gonna wear this style or the chunky style. So for me, these are perfect. I know I'm gonna get so much use out of them as I've said for like everything in this video very similar in terms of the style like they're still quite chunky and quite they've got like a little bit of a platform as well which is similar to what she's got on in the photo so just love an all white trainer like they just look so beautiful and fresh and knowing me I'm gonna completely ruin them but yeah pretty much spot on what can I say and obviously again like I said koi trainers so comfortable so affordable they last really well as well for the money which I love so I'm excited to try all of that on and show you the finished looks I'm gonna get some Instagram content as well because I feel like it'll be fun to see like the photos like my photo and their photo side by side for each celeb but yeah I really hope you guys enjoyed this video I apologize for the light in because honestly it's so dark and like crusty and dusty outside at the minute like it's just basically might not even be summer um, but yeah huge thank you to Koi for sponsoring this video as well like I said you can use the code Hannah 30 if you want to shop on the website I feel like I'm speaking really quick today like I'm really like got a lot of energy in me you know but yeah I love you guys as always if you want to see another one of these videos let me know but apart from that I will see you in the next one bye